Hello. I am, it's Thursday. I'm just getting ready for my first appointment. I don't know why I'm moving in slow motion today. I'm a bit tired, a bit of a headache. Um, but then I realized I did not clean up my studio fully on whatever day of my weekends, Monday, because I was so exhausted. So oh, now I have to do that now, hopefully before my time drops. I got a new Speedy Nail Supply order. I was having a bad day yesterday, so normally I like to keep them and open them with you. But I was having a bad day because I was very stressed. Um, so I opened it. So I'll just show you what's in it in a second. In a second for you, but like probably later today for me. Okay, I have a few minutes to spare. So my client's a few minutes late. So I'm gonna show you what I got. Come on, and thank you card. So cute. Then from Divok, TV okay? I got this matte top coat. Which is supposed to be used for chrome work. So apparently if you lay this down before you do your non-white detailing, chrome doesn't stick to this top coat at all. So I'm really excited to give that a whirl. Um, I was using the gel bubbles all in one builder, which worked fine, but it was like, you really, really, really had to make sure it was like wiped down perfectly for it to work well. Um, with this, you don't. So that's nice. I'm excited to give that a whirl. And then I have the Mosteve Aurora Beam. Mosteve Aurora Beam Tint Drop. Okay, so these are like all different like alcohol inks, but they're like clear or kind of milky-ish and they're just like shimmery. So the first one's white and the others are shimmery. It's kind of hard to pick up on camera, but you can kind of see. Hmm, doesn't really show. I feel like the first one shows the best, but all the other ones are really pretty. That's like a red. Next one's a green, and the last one is more of a bluish, I think. So I'm gonna play with those later. And finally, the candy, Sweet Candy Union Neon Syrup. I'm so excited about these. So, A, the packaging. I think cute. Um, but then also just like the consistency of them. Let's fold it. This is so beautiful. I'll do close-ups obviously of all these so I can show you later when I'm swatching them. But yeah, beyond yeah, excited for these. So I'm gonna give this a play. I have two mystery minis tomorrow. So I think the second of the day she'll be getting these. Those crystals that were on her nails, she actually brought in to match um, a necklace that she's wearing for a wedding. And then she left the crystals for me to keep, which is very nice. So I'm going to quickly like decant those into my little charm boxes. Some of them already came in like the, you know, the little boxes that crystals come in. But others are in little pouches, so I'm gonna drop them and then decant them.
my first plant of the day. I have three in total today. My first one was actually at 9 a.m., which is an early start because that client flying to France tonight to get married, which is very fun. So I have her, had her, and then I have two mystery manis today, which I'm really looking forward to. So I'm just gonna eat some pasta quick before my next client arrives. I'm really excited for both my mystery manis. I drew them out, they're looking very cute. So it's gonna be very fun. First going to arrive. Um, two appointments today. One just a tier one nail art. We're doing something simple with nude and chrome for an easy grow out. And then the second will be a mystery mani, but that's the mystery mani that I have the agreement on, where I just choose a random set from my client's Pinterest board, uh, which is fun. So that'll be the second of the day, and that's it. Very mellow. Mellow day. For some reason, I thought I was going to be here till like 8.30 tonight. And when Pat asked me this morning, and I checked and it was like 6.30. It's just super chill. Um, it's rainy today and gross. Happy to be inside. So I'm just going to get prepped. My client should be here in about 15 minutes. In the meantime, I'm going to practice my Japanese. Just arrived at the studio. Just getting ready, got a busy day today. The next two days are quite busy actually, because um, I had to cancel some appointments at the end of this week um, to go do some family stuff. So I tried to squeeze as many people as I could into this little time frame. Um, it's a busy day, got a lot to do, a lot of nails to do, um, three appointments today, all of them aren't. Just finished my first of the day. I have about an hour into my next one because we finished a little bit early, so I'm going to get all cleaned up. Oh, and then I made, okay, I don't really cook, but I made a stir fry last night. I followed a TikTok recipe for a healthy stir fry, and it is good. So I have, I made so much, like six or seven meals worth, so I'm gonna go have a, a round of that. I should actually go home and heat it up. Ooh, maybe I'll do that. Or maybe I'll just eat it cold. a bit early because I have a mystery mani this evening and I want to make some more Tamagotchi charms. Um, I already have a bunch made, of course, 
Ooh, and maybe some more gummy bears. But I want to make some with my new sweet candy gel from uh, the Union Collection. I think that'd be very cute. Maybe some bows and stuff. So I'm going to quickly do that. I have about 45 minutes until my client arrives. My first client of the day. I have three in total. Um, so yeah, I'm going to make some more charms. my first I just finished two appointments of the day it's literally after six now it's not first anything but I just finished my two appointments and I had a third but unfortunately she had to cancel so Pat just brought me some dinner he's heading out I was gonna go home but he's going out so instead I'm going to do my own nails because I've been desperate to do my own nails and I'm for three weeks and they've been driving me nuts um three weeks isn't a long time but I'm just I didn't think I was gonna keep them on that look uh, anyway so I'm gonna quickly eat my dinner. Looks like Pad see you, which I'm excited about. And watch Jewish matchmaking, Jewish matchmaker, while I eat. Because one of my clients told me I need to watch that. Um and then I'm gonna start my own nails. I don't know what I'm doing, which stresses me out, but we'll see. Okay, I'm just gonna work on some test nails before I start on my own nails to see if I wanna do bubble nails. If I don't wanna do bubble nails, I literally I have no clue what to do.
but I really couldn't decide what to do. I did my base, I removed my last set, did my base, it's all prepped with base coat, a bit of builder, and I just threw a top coat on, and it's almost 10 p.m. So I'm gonna go home, leave my nails nude for now, think about things, I mean, they look nice, even just like, glousy. But uh, think about things, because I couldn't decide if I wanted to do the bubble nails, because I really love them, but I just feel like my last set I just wasn't in the mood for anymore, so now I just really feel like something I'm in the mood for. And what I feel like I'm in the mood for is like black syrup base with like syrup stars, or like all over black and silver hollow confettis, stars. I'm really in a star mood. Anyways, this is the end of this vlog. I will show you what I end up doing with my nails, so I just don't leave you hanging, but there will be a full video of that, um, I'm sure. Um, but thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Enjoy me and my stove. I'm going home. The fireworks are happening. I'm gonna go see if I can see them from my bedroom window. Toodaloo. Thank you.